Cyberduck 6.0 was released on May 9, 2017. The new version of the popular file transfer browser introduces support for OneDrive, Encryptimator among other things. Cyberduck is a file transfer and management software for Windows and Mac OS X which we reviewed in 2011 for the first time. Back then it was one of the programs that you could use to upload documents to Google Docs. Cyberduck works similar to FTP programs, only that it supports more than just FTP or SFTP. You may use it to connect to WebDAV, Amazon S3, Backblaze B2, Microsoft Azure, OneDrive, Google Cloud, Dropbox, and OpenStack Swift servers. You may add accounts to Cyberduck permanently. Adding an account depends largely on the service that you are selecting. Some, like SFTP, work directly, while others require that you authorize the Cyberduck program first. Once that is out of the way, you may start any connection that you have added to Cyberduck with a click of the mouse. While you can save the password for extra comfort, you can also select not to save it for extra security. The new version of the application introduces several features to the application. Most noteworthy, probably, are support for Microsoft OneDrive, and support for the file encryption software Cryptimator. You may link OneDrive accounts in the latest version, and this works exactly like it does when you add Dropbox or Google Cloud accounts. Select to connect to OneDrive, enter your Microsoft account email address and password, and accept the authorization prompt on the Microsoft website to authorize CyberDuck to access the storage. OneDrive becomes available then, and you may use CyberDuck to browse the storage, upload and download files, or manage files in other ways for instance by deleting or renaming them. Cryptimator support on the other hand is special, as the software is not a storage provider but adds encryption options to your online storage. Basically, what it allows you to do is encrypt your files before they are pushed to the cloud. This does not affect local files as they are readable thanks to Cryptimator doing all the heavy lifting in the background. Support for Cryptimator in Cyberduck means that the application supports encrypting uploads to the vault, and decrypting downloads from the vault. Cyberduck 6 ships with a handful of other features that users may find interesting. You may use it to browse the local file system. Support for the SSH RSA Cert V01 at OpenSh.com and SSH DSA Cert V01 at OpenSh.com formats were added. Support for lifecycle options for buckets and the copying of pre authenticated URLs for BlackBlaze B2 was added. Closing words The main thing that CyberDuck has going for it is that it can be used to tap into different storage services and servers using a single interface. This strength plays out the best if you connect to several storage providers regularly, and don't want to install programs that these providers offer on your system, if they do offer software. Now you, how do you manage online storage?